we are not affiliated with any government entity, any governments, any SAR entities or organizations. We are strictly private persons seeking to recover the missing. Searching near the last known point, moving up. Actually, it's gonna be further down and trailing the central ridge. Commencing search from the beginning of the ridge and basically going towards where Jim had parked down there. Taking, and we saw quite a few hunters drive by on the back. They had some game. Looks like they had a good day. We're searching for the missing. Visibility is good. We tend to want to check such areas where things can be obscured. No contact. I'm being realistic, recovery isn't gonna happen here. Uh, if Jem was here, he could easily see the other hill and know where his truck is. Search and rescue isn't dumb. If Jem was here, the road's right there. Look at it, look at it. Jem's truck would have been straight out there, straight down there uh, at the, uh, you know what we mean uh, by the road. This area is a little more promising searching. We previously covered into this ravine, sort of, this whole section down and up, up and down. Now we're gonna be taking the area that is less, uh, based on the map anyway, uh, not really uh, canvassed previously. And for that, we do want to do the snake crawl. At the base to the ridge, there are bones, but these are self-evidently animal bones. Clearly. Remember, based on the snapshot, SAR had canvassed the contours. They had canvassed the contours uh, past the, uh, below the ridge. So what we want to cover, uh, uh, below the ridge, what we want to cover is the knit section, less canvas. At the base of the central, no, at, 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 the, at the central ridge, looking this way, uh, don't insult Jim's intelligence. No, SAR did canvas parts, uh, parts of the top section, but as, a, but as a whole, this little hill, we are canvassing the areas that are not uh, well gridded. Uh, after this, we're done. Right now, we feel nothing but anger free-floating anger uh, as a legal clarification our rage and anger is directed at no persons or entities it is entirely self inward directed frustration at our inability to find Jim it is beautiful you look at the snow you feel your rage and anger dissipate it's amazing. No correction, it's not snow. It's just slushy rain right now. Slushy rain. Search ongoing. We are really angry at our inability to find Jim. Okay, that is true snow. This is snow, not rain. It's coming down pretty good. It is. It is beautiful. Majestic. Majestic God of nature and nature's God. Don't admire the beauty. We're searching. 
based on my interpretation of the star map snapshot, while well, these are type of areas we would like to search, based on our interpretation of snapshot, a SAR hadn't thoroughly uh, gridded this area for uh, very obvious reasons. They did a great job. We are not going to re-canvas what Search and Rescue has already thoroughly canvassed. We are proceeding to the dead center point, dead center of the ridge, the ridge central, and proceed down. We've reached the top and we'll proceed down on the search, searching dead center, which means dead center, the ridge, following the ridge. The snow is really distracting from the search, but we'll be breaking off the search in a moment. The snow has stopped. We are continuing on the search, on our search. Jim may have kept walking up that away, taking him towards the pool. We may want to search the adjacent hillside, but further up as opposed to previously searched sections. Not sure what this is. Is it marking a tree for protection or was it put there by the search and rescue team searching for Jim? I don't know. If this is from the search and rescue, then we are being redundant. Searching adjacent to the creek Basically, we're heading in the direction of the pond. Obviously, just lost a little bit of elevation to avoid some obstacles. But um, I see no reason why the hell on earth would Jim scramble up these sides. It would make zero sense. What we mean is there's no reason for Jim to scramble up these sides because his path back to his truck is gonna be that away. Another one of those orange ribbons. Interesting. Still working our way towards the pond along the uh, along the uh, forested area adjacent to that little running stream. Now, DJ would know exactly what we're talking about. Uh, basically, we just passed the pond as a little that way. So now we're going to head back down towards the pond and back out. Concluding the search. No contact. Concluding our search. I am stumped. More stumped than before. No clue. End of search, getting out of here. And many days ago, we gone up, canvassed some of those, those sections, found a pair of glasses. It weren't gems. The point of today's search was to uh, cover the end point past where Jim had parked cover that hill and then work this wooded section up to the pond. Now we are ending the search. We're ending, uh, I'm ending my search. If there are other professional searchers, uh, note that is animal that's laying just next to the side adjacent to this uh, closed road trail thingy so that's that's animals so people don't get confused jim shadid is not a mystery jim shadid is a person a man it is not a mystery i cannot find him simply because i'm not good at searching 
to drum. May your spirit be at peace with the eternal blessings of God.